Hello folks, Jim here at RC Hill Honda of Deland. We have just got our new 2018 Touring models in. The Goldwing Tour comes in two different fashions. We have the manual transmission, six speeds finally, and then we have the DCT seven speed. Now there's a whole lot of this motorcycle that leans right back to its heritage. It does have rubber wheels just like what the old one had. Outside of that, what we're dealing with here is we're dealing with an 1833cc four-valve unicam motor, which is more compact and more powerful. It's also a little bit farther up on the bike due to the twin wishbone suspension up front, all new, only time Honda's ever done it. With that, it puts the passenger cabin at a much much better angle for protection it's 90 pounds lighter it's not as wide it's much more maneuverable but it still has that heritage of the gold wing able to tour with a nice pocket and a great spot for your protection all right folks uh, we did just get these in a day and a half ago we got them assembled and up on the floor yesterday in between trying to make a living, uh, we have had a chance to play around with these a little bit. So if I make any mistakes, please don't be too harsh on me. This is new technology and I am an old guy. So, you don't have a key anymore. Now you have a fob that you're going to carry around in your pocket just like what you do uh, for all the new modern vehicles. So right up here you have your on and off switch. You simply turn that. You'll see that it boots up. It's gonna come up with that beautiful Honda symbol for the wing. Right here is your start button. And it's that simple to fire it up. Now what you'll notice is now your gauge package gives you so much information that it's gonna take you a while to get used to taking it in. Over here, you're gonna have air temperature, you're gonna have your trim, you're gonna have your tire pressure. Of course, you have your speedometer in both kilometers and miles per hour. You've got your tachometer over here, you've got your neutral signal. This right here will tell you what gear you're in. Now, you have four different modes. You have the touring mode, you have the sport mode, you have the economy mode, and then you have the rain mode. I think the rain mode pretty much explains itself, but if uh, you don't understand it, that means that puts the traction control in the highest setting for safety. Over here, you have the ability to set the vehicle up for one rider, for a rider with a loaded saddlebag, for a rider with a passenger, for a rider with a passenger and a loaded saddlebag. What that does is that enables you to make some quick settings and adjust on the fly. You still do have an adjustable rear suspension, but this is kind of for some quick settings on the side. One of the coolest things here, and uh, I, I look at it and I see it. I don't know if y'all can see this little tiny motorcycle here that looks like it's pointing up a hill. Believe it or not, guys, this is called Hill Assist. You no longer have to worry about can I feather the, the throttle enough to keep me from sliding backwards? The bike knows when you're on an incline and will not let you roll backwards and you give it throttle and off you go. How many tense moments have we had with that, folks? All right, I'm gonna shut her down right now because I'm gonna cover a couple of other things that we've got going on here. You have your cruise control set, you have your set, you have your uh, resume. Of course, we have our emergency quill switch, which also serves as a start. Right here you have your automatic or your manual selection. We happen to be sitting on the DCT. For most people, that English means we're on a fully automatic motorcycle. You have your neutral selection and you have your drive selection. Once you are in drive, the different operating modes, whether it be touring, rain, sport, or econo, chooses how the transmission shifts to achieve those desired effects the most. When you get over here, you have a new, first time ever on a Goldwing, power windshield. It has almost five inches of movement. That means when you're in the city and you need to get a little air in there to breathe and avoid some of that carbon monoxide, you're all good. When you get out on that uh, freeway, cause you need to put some miles underneath you, you have this great little cockpit right here of nice calm air. 
Of course we have the radio, and of course we have the ability to shift this motorcycle should we choose to. Here is a really, really cool feature. See the little motorcycle right here with the plus and minus? What we have now is we have the ability not to only have the reverse, which we all know the Goldwing is famous for, but we also have a forward walking speed. How often have you got on your Goldwing and you had to put it in gear, move up, go back to neutral, reactivate the reverse, go backwards, back into neutral, first gear, go forward, there is no more of that jogging from this point on. You just push a button and it controls which way you want to go. Of course, once you have your Apple CarPlay activated, yes, Apple CarPlay, once you have that activated with the proper headset and the microphone, you can listen to music on your phone, you can listen to uh, pretty much anything you want to listen to on the phone. You can make phone calls. Don't advise it, you really need to be enjoying it, but just in case you have to answer the babysitter, you can. We know you're gonna ignore the boss, but the babysitter you're gonna have to answer for. So right now, folks, I, uh, we're gonna take a little bit of a tour around the rest of the motorcycle. As I learn more about this, as I ride it, this one is not a demo. I am not allowed to ride this one because they don't want too many miles on it before somebody, the lucky person that gets it first. We do have a gentleman over here in the parking lot that states it's his bike, but uh, until we see the green, it's still ours. All right, we figured you'd like a nice close-up look at the fob that you're uh, talking about here. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to take it and stick it in my pocket right now. I'm going to walk over here to the bike and I'm going to notice that we no longer have levers to open the bike up anymore. Now we have buttons. We simply push the button, open goes the side bag. We have another button right here, up comes the trunk. Nice spacious trunk, plenty enough storage here for an overnight trip with you and your uh, whoever she happens to be, hopefully your uh, significant other. Simply push up lightly and there you go. Hey, one of the most impressive things that we have going on this new Gold Wing is if you'll notice these do not look like your normal uh, shocks coming down here on a motorcycle. We have the double wishbone single shock what this does is, is that instead of the tire moving up and into the motorcycle as you hit the bumps, now the tire goes straight up and down. What that means is potholes no longer jar your teeth out of their head. You're just going to ride down the road, it's going to be smooth, it's going to be reactive, and you're not going to have to deal with the vibration and the kickback that you have from the standard shock setup. You know folks, first time I saw the headlights on this, I was going, man, they look familiar. And then I just remembered, there is a high-end car that has the same lights. It's an, oh, it's an Acura. Oh my God. It's, oh, this must be the cousin. This is awesome. Check this out. We got LED lights. Every single bulb is LED. That means, I don't know what you'd put on it, but you're not going to have a problem with draining too much out of your uh, alternator on this one. All right, if you're still hanging in there, well, we're about done now. We have one last thing for you. We'd like you to see what everybody else in the motorcycle industry is going to see when you come and get your new Goldwing and that is just your behind. That is all that they're going to get to see because nobody, nobody's going to sell you a finer motorcycle than the new 2018 Honda Goldwing and they're not going to be able to hear it because you're going to be so far in front of them but I'm going to turn it on just so that you can hear what this beauty sounds like yourself. And I'm going to turn this beauty on and you're going to hear a motor that purrs like you've never heard on a motorcycle before. Not loud and obnoxious. What we have is a finely tuned machine. All right, folks, we certainly appreciate you paying attention to this video. If you've made it this far, then I'm not as annoying as people tell me I am. 
but we do appreciate it. Please come by and visit us here at RC Hill Honda of Deland. We're always happy to see anybody that comes by and appreciates a fine motorcycle.